More than 21 million people live within 50 miles of Long Island Sound's shores. This number will increase in a few years as population is on the rise. The Long Island Sound is home to a diverse number of plants, animals, and habitats. The Sound is an estuary of national importance as it provides habitat for wildlife and income to many economies. The Long Island Sound provides habitat for four species of sea turtle, many species of fish, as well as the salt marsh and eelgrass meadows that are among the most biologically productive places on the planet. There are many ways to protect the sound, and these methods range from curbing usage of herbicides and pesticides around the home, to thinking of novel solutions to protecting this valuable resource. Take for example what the village of Northport is doing for its harbor, farming sugar kelp. We now turn to Northport's village trustee for an overview of Northport's sugar kelp farm. Cornell Cooperative Extension has uh, implemented a pilot program here in Northport Harbor. The uh, pilot program consists of um, seeding kelp that we've monitored since January here in the harbor. So in January we went out and uh, in between two moorings we strung a poly line and on that poly line was a seeded nylon line that was um, strewn through with tiny, tiny kelp seeds. Here in Northport Harbor, we are in the bottom of a valley and all the runoff from the neighbors, the neighboring streets and, and towns all the way from Centerport to um, East Northport, it all funnels down to the harbor. And unfortunately, not all of the, uh, the um, fertilizers and whatnot that's used on lawns gets filtered out. So it, eventually it does end up here um, in the harbor. The nitrogen um, um, you know, feeds the algae and uh, obviously it's not good for the harbor. Kelp is a good product for us to um, clean out the harbor. It takes all the bad stuff, the nitrogen, the carbon dioxide out of the water and puts all the good stuff in it, oxygen, namely oxygen, and um, that's good for uh, marine life. The kelp is going to clean the water to the point where other shellfish are going to thrive. We'd like to thank Mr. Weber for that incredible overview of the village's efforts. Kelp can improve water quality through ecosystem services such as nutrient bioextraction, also known as removing nutrients. Seaweed can store nutrients such as nitrogen and phosphorus within its tissue. When the seaweed is harvested, the excess nutrients in the water column are effectively removed from the system. Nutrient pollution has substantial impacts on our harbor and sounds. Thanks, Mr. Weber, for sharing a real-life example of saving the sound and showing us how kelp farms are an integral part of saving the marine environment. In the meantime, do your part. Think about what you put in your drains and on your lawn. More importantly, get out into nature and become a steward of the environment. <laughs>